Christmas. It's the holiday of the year. Trees that twinkle, beautiful gifts to be opened. Isn't Christmas grand? Perhaps not. If you're alone, like Jennifer in her first apartment far from family, or like Norm, whose divorce alienated him from his kids and grandkids, or like Harriet, now living alone in a care center. Christmas isn't grand if you're alone. I want to live my life closer to thee. Being alone at Christmas may not be a situation you can change. Distance from loved ones, fractured relationships, declining health and limited mobility, these all can isolate us while the world rolls on in the merriment and sparkle of the season. But you are not alone. Through Isaiah, God said, Comfort, comfort my people. Our gracious God hears the cries of lonely people. And he comes to comfort them. Zechariah, the father of John the Baptist, affirmed that comfort when he proclaimed, Because of the tender mercy of our God, whereby the sunrise shall visit us from on high, to give light to those who sit in darkness and the shadow of death. Being alone at Christmas can be as overwhelming as sitting in the dark fearing impending death. In the loneliness of Christmas, are you crying out, Lord, have mercy on me. Our gracious God hears you. He knows your lonely feelings. The comfort of Christmas, my friend, is Jesus Christ. He is Emmanuel, that is, God with us. You are not alone. God is merciful to you. He brings the light of Christ into the darkness of your world with his words of comfort and joy. During the difficult days and moments of the Christmas season, turn to Christ, the comfort of Christmas. Pray with me. I feel an emptiness being alone, O oh Lord. Comfort me with your presence. Bring your light into the darkness of my soul and help me know the true comfort and joy of Christmas. Jesus, Emmanuel, God with me. Amen. Thanks for joining us. If you're seeking services for symptoms of mental illness, please talk to your primary doctor or a health professional. Don't have one? Consider one of the resources listed here to find help. And God's peace to you.